On this episode of Global Positive News, a little girl became the first person in California to get a unicorn ownership license. I'm Christy Kern, let's get right into it. Well, this is a really sweet story. Some football players walked shelter dogs onto the field before a game to promote adoption. This is according to BoardPanda.com. So the Zenit football team joined forces with an animal foundation in 2021 to get attention to the so many pets who needed loving homes. The players actually carried the dogs before a Premier League match. Aw, this is such a sweet idea. Everyone got to see those pups. And the best part is that all the dogs were able to find loving homes. And a lonely reindeer at a sanctuary found a partner just in time for Christmas. Aw, this is according to BBC. Sven is a reindeer at Little Haven Farm in the UK. He felt lonely after losing his companion, Kloss. So the farm owner named Susie started a crowdfunding campaign to bring in a friend from another farm. So this is Daisy and she and Sven has become very close friends. And Susie says it was basically love at first sight. It's brought a lot of joy back to Sven's life. And we are going to get to that story about a little girl who became the first person in California to get a unicorn ownership license in just a minute. But first, just a reminder to subscribe to the GPNN YouTube channel. You can just search at Global Positive News Network on YouTube and hit subscribe. You'll find several of these videos posted every week. We'll be breaking down some of the most positive and also uplifting stories you see on the GPNN platforms. It's really the perfect way to stay up to date with your news while still adding a smile and some positivity to your day. Well, it started with just five families and now hundreds of kids and their parents bike to school together in Barcelona. How cool is this? This is according to theguardian.com. The parents and the kids ride together on the bike bus at eight o'clock in the morning on weekdays. The pictures of the kids on their bikes are just so sweet. The idea is a way to promote cycling as a healthy choice for transportation. They share their routes for others to join and they even have police escorts for their safety. And now the idea is even spreading to other cities in Spain and all around the world. And this is my favorite story of the day. A little girl became the first person in California to get a unicorn ownership license. This is according to CBS News. So the little girl actually wrote a note with this request. It says, quote, Dear LA County, I would like your approval if I can have a unicorn in my backyard, if I can find one. Please send me a letter in response. Aw, I just love this. So this happened just days before Christmas and LA's Animal Control granted the little girl named Madeline permission to have a unicorn in her backyard with conditions, of course, like making sure she has sunlight, horn polishing and non-toxic sparkles. They also gave her a stuffed unicorn to keep with her while she searches for a real one. And before we go, if you are looking to add some positivity to your day, look no further than this. Check out these gold ball bracelets. They say things like love, luck, and positivity. I just love them. I think they are simple and elegant. They are also unisex. It's really the perfect way to help you stay positive throughout the day. You can check out the link to get yours today from the GPN store. That is all for today. Make sure you subscribe to the GPNN YouTube channel. I've been your host, Christy Kern.